here. Welcome back to my channel. Um, a long time no see. Today I have a quick little Burlington haul because I've been trying to get some cute stuff there. I've been seeing some really cute stuff there, so I'm really excited to show you guys everything I bought. Um, before I get started, I just want to add a little disclaimer. I am super blind. Um, I broke my glasses and I haven't got a new one, so if I squint, that's because I'm trying to see if you can see what I'm showing you guys or whatever. I'm trying to see the screen. Um, and my camera's far away, so I'm squinting. And, yeah, I think that's about it. Um, without further ado, let's get right into this video. So, um, one of the first things that I want to show is this whitening gel pen pack. And it has a pack of two, and it has um, teeth whitening gel on the pen. So I guess you just kind of like brush it on your teeth. I don't know if you guys seen those before. And... Um, I bought it for $5.99 and you're not going to be able to see that because it's so far away. I'm going to try and figure out a better um, filming setup. Just This is my first video back again this year so just bear with me and then I'm going to try and figure it out so the next video could be way better but I'm really excited to try these because usually I just buy the gel that like squirts out and I either put it in like a retainer and you know, put them in for like 10 minutes or I get Q-tips and I rub it on every single tooth for 10 minutes. So I'm really excited to try the brush pens. And I'll let you guys know how those work. Then the next thing that I got is this um, Bebe bronzer, highlighter, and blush. Um, little compact and I'm really excited to try it out because I haven't tried a Bebe um, makeup product. So we'll see how it like looks on my skin. I love wearing blush and bronzer, so... That would be fun. And it was only $3.99. I just thought this was going to be really easy to um, keep in my purse. Instead of having to keep like a blush and a bronzer and a highlighter, I just have one that has all three already. So, excited to try that out. Oh my God. So, was this candle? Okay, I love candles. So, um, I tried to find cheap, cheap, good smelling candles so I could have one burning at all times. And then um, I saved my good candles, like um, pink or Bath Body Works candles for when I have like people over. So I don't know. I think this one just smells like clean laundry or like a clean bathroom or almost even like a clinic. Like a very clean, nice smelling clinic. So, and this one was on clearance for $3.99. That's why it has a red tag. So anytime I see something with a red tag, I try to get it. I try to buy on clearance just because I like to shop a lot. So if I can, um, if I don't really need it and I can find something like that's on clearance, I'll probably still get it. Then the next thing that I got, I should, so this is in no particular order. I should have organized myself a little better with this video, but I'll just do it randomly. Um, so I got like some beauty products and household products like that candle, um, yeah, so the next thing that I got is this Bebe Color Glow Palette, and it's supposed to have, like, different blushes, highlighters, and bronzers. Um, does it have it? So, yeah, I guess they're just blushes, highlighters, and bronzers, even though some of this, like, this purple I would never use as a blush. So, I don't know if it's intended for highlight, and it actually is because it has highlight, duh. Um, otherwise, I was going to be like, I would honestly use these as eyeshadows, TBH, because they're pretty pigment. I don't know the pigments that I should do a swatch. Oh my god. Sorry guys, I'm new. I'm, I'm barely coming back, so I'm very unprepared. Like, I don't have a pair of scissors, which is kind of necessary when you're doing, like, doing hauls so you can open things. Um, but before I toss this, it's it was $6.99, this um, 10 color palette, so... You probably won't be able to see the swatches from so far away, but I just want to swatch some for myself so I can give you guys a personal my opinion on them. Um, okay, so they look... This blush looks like cute. This purple one, I would have thought this was too dark, but it's not um, as pigmented once you rub it in, so... This might not be like... I'm just going to try all the pinks. Oh my god, this... this that's in the middle here is has to be my favorite 
So if you guys go to your local Burlington, I did see quite a few of these, so maybe they got some in and you can get try your own because these are really nice. So I'm gonna try this brown, which is gonna be my bronzer probably. Yep. Actually, I would love that for my eyeshadow. I love using brown on the eyelid when I'm trying to do natural looks, so um, that's the perfect shade for that. So I'm really excited to use this for only $7, which is really good. See, just the way I bend down to pick things up, I should have thought this out more for me to have, but whatever. So fuck, fuck packaging right now. I have like three broken nails as well, so I'm so sorry. Um, at the quality of this video, I'm just trying to um, get my consistency of uploading, and, like filming, editing, and uploading going, and then I can work like on the quality, the editing, the background, all that. But I'm gonna use this hand. I hope I can't even remember to wash my hands before starting this video, which means I probably didn't. And I'm touching the makeup that's gonna go on my face. So if I you see me breaking out, you know why. Um, okay, let's try the highlighter. Okay, it looks like passed out orange, but I can see the highlight. <laughs> Honestly, not the best quality. Like I wouldn't um, recommend. Not saying that I would not recommend, but I would also not just recommend this highlight. Um, so I could probably just use that for powder, honestly. So, or well, I don't know, because it does have some highlight to it, but it's not all that. It's not all that highlight. So let's see the blush. The blush looks promising. For someone that doesn't like to wear too much heavy blush, like a very pigmented blush, this will definitely work. Um, not my favorite little palette, but you know what? For emergencies, this will this will have to do in um, one of my travel makeup bags. And the bronzer is honestly not too dark, so I think I can definitely build up the bronzer and the blush on my face. I want to go more natural, not too full coverage, so I think this is going to, um, this is going to, I'm going to get some use out of this. For $3.99, I'm not complaining, honestly. And then, I don't know how long this video is going to be. I can't really see how long I've been filming for, so there's like just some stuff, but um, then the next thing that I got is this little Spongebob mug, so I just moved into my new apartment, I used to live in a studio and it was freaking tiny, and I was so young, I think I was 19 when I moved into that place, um, turning 20, no, I was 20 moving into that place, turning 21, and so, um, I was very irresponsible. I'm still pretty irresponsible, but I'm trying to get the hang of it. So um, I didn't really upkeep the kitchen. Like I didn't have too much um, kitchen appliances or anything like that, like dishes, dish wise and stuff. So I'm really trying to cook at home more and just like really make it make my home look like a home instead of a dorm room. So. I'm trying to get a cute mug collection, so I definitely had to get pick up this SpongeBob one that I found, and it was only $4.99, so I thought, why not? Like, it looks like I could fit a lot of coffee in here. I have to have my coffee, so I'm really excited to use that, and um, I'm really excited to see what other um, mugs I can find for my collection. And then these straws, so this is a pack of reusable straw sets. Um, I picked it up, it was $9.99, I think it comes with four, six straws and the one cleaning brush. And the thing about these, they're like cheetah print and everything, they're super cute, I'm really excited to start using these so that I don't have to keep collecting the straws from the fast food restaurants in here so that I can use the straw at home. But um, this one, I actually got it at the gift store in the casino, it's the Swig Life brand. Um, and then just, I think it was like Circus Circus here in, in Reno, um, so yeah, this was just near the cup, so I thought I would throw, this, throw that in this video, but you can definitely find packs of reusable straws at Burlington, so if you really want, would like to, you know, save the planet and not use so many, um, plastic straws, this is what I need, uh, scissors for it. Yeah, I would recommend you guys to start 
Hop in on that reusable straw trim, please. Just so that we can um, last a little longer. Then I also got this pack of, I would say they're one, two, three, four, five, six, six cups. Um, this one was $3.99. Um, and they're also cheetah print. And I really, like I said, I want to start um, having like a bunch of cute kitchen wear, but I also, um, like I want to make it look like a home, but I also want to make it look like a very girly home. So I'm trying to get all my kitchen appliances, I don't know if these are appliances or kitchenware, to be cute. So I'm trying to find like pink knives and shit, like things like that. So I'm really excited to have like plastic cups. Anyone just wants like a glass, not a glass, but like a couple of juice or something, and then um, have glassware. Anyone wants like a soda or something, have some wine glasses, have some shot glasses. Um, and things like that. Oh, oh, the next thing that I got, I'm so excited for this one because it's this perfume I found, a Nicki Minaj, um, the Minajesty Nicki Minaj perfume. I've always wanted a Nicki Minaj perfume ever since I was like in middle school. And uh, no one ever got, gifted me one when I was little and then when I was older, I just forgot. So when I saw this, I had to get it. It's so freaking cute. It smells so bomb. How would I describe it? Like just like a classy, classy, um, feminine, very like, just so good. Very good. Um, but yeah. And this, I got it for $14.99. It was only $14.99, which is crazy because it's 1.7 fluid ounces. Um, I would have definitely paid like $50 for it, so for $15, I'm down. Um, so yeah, and then the box has a picture of Nikki, and she looks fabulous, and I just, I can't wait to find the other, like, other perfumes so I can collect them, the bottles, but I've been using it a lot, so I'm gonna need to look for another one so I can have two, so I can have one for everyday use, and then one for the bottle, just for decoration, because it's so fucking cute. Um, if anyone wants to give me anything, they can give me perfumes that are, like, in shapes, like the Kim perfume I really want. I don't know what it's called. Any of the perfumes. Um, what's it called? The next thing that I got is this Hot Tools. And this, they were selling it for $39.99. I don't know how much it is originally. Um, this is... Yeah, $39.99. So I got it for $40. Bucks, which is standard. Like, you, for a good styling tool, whether it be a straightener or just a simple curling iron, a simple blow iron blow dryer well you could honestly get one for like 20 bucks a blow dryer but like i feel like the standard styling stool that you want really do want to last and like take treat your hair right and everything should spend at least 40 dollars on maybe 50 so because they go up to like over 100 and anyways i got this styling brush and it's like um uh, for those of you guys who've never used this or don't know what it is if i could describe it it's just like a blow dryer inside the bristles of a brush so that way instead of having like a blow dryer like brushing your hair with a, and then blowing your hair at the same time with a blow dryer you brush it and it's like blowing air at the same time and it leaves your hair just um i don't even know how to describe it like fabulous like if you want a nice blowout this is how you get that you you need one of these and um i'm barely trying to get the hang of my own doing blow up, blowouts at home so once I get the hang of it I'm definitely want to do like a tutorial video on it um but yeah I definitely recommend you guys to watch some of those tutorials on YouTube and purchase one of these because you will feel like there's days when you want to look like straight your hair has sleek straight hair point like pointy at the bottom and everything and there's days when you just want like a natural kind of classic wave but yet like um silky and <clears throat> classy look, I definitely recommend one of these to achieve that look. Then the next thing that I got, I guess I should have kept putting things in here, is this little set of three baskets. Um, it's just customized, customizable space organizer um, baskets. They were $7.99, $8 for three bas plastic baskets. I don't know. Why I got these, I feel like I could have found something bigger for $8, but um, 
I'm sure I can find something to put in here. So that there's no point in opening those. And then um, the next thing that I bought. I kind of forgot what I bought because this I bought these a couple of ago, so it's good. I'm buying them all over again or opening everything. Um oh okay, so this was $6.99 and this I got to put my hand soap so that whenever whenever anyone goes inside the bathroom it's it's like a cute hand soap, so I don't know if you guys can see, but they're kind of like black gray um, with glitter on it, and it's from the red brand. I don't even know if that's a good brand or not, but I've been seeing it a lot in fucking Burlington, like the whole haul. Most of it is from that. I don't know why. But I just thought these were the cutest bathroom things, and when I lived in my other studio before, I have fucking, I have like a hand soap and toothbrush holder and stuff from the Dollar from the 99 cent store and it was like um little rubber duckies and they looked like baby like for a baby bathroom oh my god so this is definitely I'm so excited this one is $4.99 and I believe this one is the toothbrush holder I didn't even put my makeup brushes in here if I find something else for my toothbrushes but as of right now I want to like have this whole look um, I just need to find two bathroom mats. So I'm on the lookout for those and shower curtains. Because um, the one that I have right now is pretty cheap. So it's wide. This one was also $4.99, and this is for the bar of soap uh, to have like on the sink. So I'm really excited. I almost don't even want to put the bar of soap because I don't use bar of soap to wash my hands. I use that in the shower. So I kind of want to just put like jewelry in here. Um, when I take off my rings to wash my hands or something, but we'll see. But I'm really excited. Um, once I get my bathroom together, I'm definitely going to want to do, like, a bathroom tour. I think that would be really, really fun. Um, so, also, another thing that I got, I forgot exactly how much this was. It was around $7.99 or something. And it's just a toilet paper holder. And I thought this was super cute with the, the little, I don't know if these are, um, gems or whatever crystal warm-ups whatever but i just thought it was super cute the only thing i will say about it is that my toilet paper rolls that i get like sometimes they're super thick it depends on the brand at the time that i buy them um so not all of them will fit in here some will be too big so i just have these that are wrapped kind of sitting there um so that they won't collect dust in the bathroom i don't know if anyone knows what I'm talking about that happens to toilet paper rolls, but yeah, so I'm super excited for that. Um, then the next thing that I got was this purse, and I took I've already been using this, so I took the tag off. I believe it was $22.99, and it's a Juicy Couture lavender um, bag. It has the over the shoulder straps, the hand handles, it has a pocket in the front with the iconic um, Juicy Couture logo um here i try to keep like important stuff here like whether it's my phone or my house keys that's super important like or like maybe my my card at the time just whatever i need like at the moment is right there and then um instead of showing everything that i have i'm just gonna do like a what's in my bag video or something so i'm just gonna start taking out a bunch of videos but um inside it does fit quite a lot of stuff um it's very roomy so it's a kind of a bigger bag. I'm used to carrying around smaller bags, but honestly, for the amount of space that you get in here, it's definitely worth it. Like I'm, I might be a big, big bag girl now. Ever since I got this bag, but I'm super excited because I just the moment I saw it, and it was the only one left, so I was just like, I have to take it. And I wish I could have found one more just so I can like give it to someone just because of how cute it is. But um, I didn't. So what I do, I would definitely. Keep um, get it for a gift. Um, the next thing that I got was this bathroom shower mat, and it was only four ninety nine. So um, I just got it there, sort of like at Walmart or something. And it has I don't know if you can see, it, but it has like um, reflective sparkles. So I just want to keep that thing up. I wish it would have been like dark instead of clear, but I want to keep that thing of um, like glittery stuff in my bathroom. We'll see how that goes. Ooh. Okay, I'm almost done, guys, okay? Uh, bear with me. Then the next thing that I got is this Bebe palette, palette with 49 shades. 
um, shimmer, both shimmer and matte shadows, and it was $10.99, and it's like, I'm going to try to show you guys, has an extensive um, variety of colors, like rainbow, shimmer, matte, everything, new, like natural neutrals, um, so I'm really excited, I don't know, pigment wise, if it's like the 10 shade palette that I showed at first, I will be so happy with it. If it's like that little three shade palette, I'm like done. But I think just because of how many colors it has, I'm gonna do a separate video um, in the future doing like my makeup or something. So then I can show you guys all the swatches just because there's so many, there's no point in me swatching all of them right now. Um, so I'm sorry. But the next thing that I got was um, were these things for your sink. So I can I have a double sink in my kitchen, and we would always try to, or like even if I um, peel a cucumber, it tries to go down the drain. So I'm I'm gonna put these like when I wash dishes or I'm like peeling fruits and vegetables, things like that, so that um, I don't get a lot of stuff cut um, caught in the garbage disposal. So yeah, I'm really excited for these. I love how little they are because then I feel like it, it 
keeps me even more organized instead of having a big drawer and just tossing up a whole bunch of shit in there. I kind of know where each individual kind of thing is at or it's easier to just pull out one, two, like see, okay, so the third one. Um, but these were $22.99, so each. So I thought that was like super like cheap, like for um, just to get myself a little bit more organized while I pick up more furniture and things like that. Um, I think I'm gonna get a lot of use out of these because then I can dedicate one like all hair stuff and have like different hair products or like all makeup and have different types of the makeup products in here, things like that. As of right now though, um, I'm in love with these. So definitely recommend you guys to, to cause look at just how cute it is. Like um, run to your Burlington and pick these up before people steal them. I don't know if these are intended for little kids, but yeah, and then I also got fuzzy hangers. I always get my fuzzy hangers, whether it's like Ross or Burlington, TJ Maxx, those kind of department stores, um, only because I love, I just want to, um, I feel like when things match, it just kind of keeps everything looking more put together and um, professional, and I just want it, I want my, I want my house to look nice, you know? So it doesn't necessarily have to look wealthy, but just like organized. Um, I believe that's it for my video. I'm definitely gonna try and upload soon, but uh, we'll see if I really stick to the consistency or not. I'm trying to post more on Instagram and other things as well, maybe on TikTok, but um, it's kind of hard because I'm just like used to doing something every day or every week. Things like that. Um, but I did want to give a shout out to Naomi Beauty. I'm going to tag her in my bio, in the description, sorry. Um, so that if you guys want to purchase any cute lashes from her, these are from her. Um, also, I can tag who did my nails. You probably won't be able to see them, but they're so cute. They're like a nude base with a highlighter color stars. The yellow, blue, pink, and orange. And they're so freaking cute. I love them. A lot of them, not a lot, but like three of them broke because I like fell and then like I closed the door on one of them and just like crazy shit that's happened to them. Not because they like are not good. Um, it's just, I don't know, like the crazy stuff that happened to me that week that I got them, that's why they broke, but they're just so cute. I want to take them all off. Um, and then shout out to JC, JCO Boutique, BTQ. I'm going to also tag them in the description down below just because I don't even know how to pronounce it. Um, but I got this jumpsuit from their website. I forgot how much I got it for, but it was super inexpensive. I believe it was maybe like $10, $20 at the most, which I doubt it was even $20. It probably was $10. And it's super cute. It's like an olive green. And then I'm wearing some boots I got for Christmas. And I just think this is a whole look. Like just cute little pigtails and just like a nice pair of lashes that's all you need pretty much and a jumpsuit just to have like a casual but um put together look i just want to get my shit together get my life together get my um look together because sometimes i'd be so lazy and i don't even brush well i do brush my hair but i don't like style my hair so i want to style really my hair more but that's what i mean like i just want to look put together because i used to not be put together um, yeah, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the bell notification to get notified every time I upload a new video. I love you guys, and I'm so glad to be back. Love you. Bye.